Hey, love bucks, it's Roslyn back at you one more again. I hope everybody is doing blessed. I'm doing blessed and highly favored and definitely hope the same for you. And if this is your first time stopping by my channel, much love to you and welcome. And to my returning subs and my grown extended beautiful family, just thank you for watching my videos, showing support. Um, our community is growing faster and faster every day. You know, people are getting more comfortable with dropping comments and, you know, spreading love towards another, you know, which is truly a blessing. It's really beautiful. I'm trying not to get emotional because I've been, like, listening to these meditations and it got me feeling really happy to the point where I'm starting to cry. So I'm just like, ugh, I hate being sappy. But anyways, uh, the video, the meditation music that I'm listening to right now is called Boost Your Aura Contra uh, Attract positive energy meditation music seven chakra balance balancing and healing and i will post that link in the description box below um y'all like i said I, my daughter only has like 11 days left on her deadline for her to get donations and i will be posting her uh website oh lord there goes that energy so y'all probably feeling my energy switch off and stuff like that because it you see in the lights bounce off the screen um i will be posting her website uh there if you can stop by and just show some love to her let her know that i sent you you know even if it's like three or four dollars it's all greatly appreciated she's just trying to get her her book out she's collaborated with different artists uh different poets and stuff they're all collaborating just to be able to show off their stuff their, the things that they do you know to help the community out they're all empaths so you know being able to show that share that love and positivity is greatly you know a great blessing um, so the video I'm doing right now is Twin Flame 101 using alchemy towards our daily routine. Yes, you know, we can have, you know, sometimes we can have a dull life. You know, we really can. Um, at times, you know, but being an alchemist of your own life, you know, at first, you know, I'm, I'm, you know, I'm learning different things about myself and about the world and how things work. Y'all, I'm so sorry. But my energy is like... <laughs> Oh my god, I keep on seeing that flash. I'm just like, let me stop moving my hands because the more I move my hands, the more flash it comes out. I don't know what's wrong with me, but it's like ever since me and my dad have converted, there it goes again. Uh, every time, ever since me and my dad converted, uh, I've been having this really strong energy that's coming in and it's just like it's in a magical way so it's like the lighting and stuff will change or you know you'll see you know flashes of light come through the video you know i've had other love bugs just like you know text me and saying rosin what's going on i see these light flashes like look i done told y'all you know since i be and my dad is like become one it's like this powerful energy is is came in and it's got me all discombobulated so uh being able to use the alchemy you know turning something very ordinary into something extraordinary is a beautiful thing you know you put using alchemy and being an alchemist of your own life and being able to convert things over to you know just this just to help you love yourself more help you push out that vibration towards other people we have so much hellish stuff going on in life right now and it's just like that's why i try to stay away from tv a lot you know i watch my little you know reality tv shows and stuff like that but i try to stay away from tv i usually just watch you know youtube a lot um i really don't watch tv that much so it's just like people are like hey rosin you heard of this no i don't watch tv like that <laughs> you know i mean it, it's just like my my ex he does and it'll leave the TV on and it just so happened if I, you know, pass by it, I'll see something that, you know, kind of throw me off and I'll see it as well. So, look at my phone. I got 999 on there. My phone's at 99% and it's like 450. So, then I'm like 999. So, I'm, you know, obviously I must be on something good right now. And, um, yeah, it's just being able to be that alchemist towards your life knowing there's better things out there for you to explore there's more things out there we, we're not knowing about but we're willing to educate ourselves we're willing to learn more about things that we need to learn about when it comes to our gifts about things that we're heading towards because like i said with this activation universe got us doing some crazy ish right now it's just like being able to, you know, see things in a different way, watching things at a different perspective, you know, everything has been heightened, you know, it just feels like, you know, if you watch horror movies, you you know, if you've seen, like, 
where I can use a, a metaphor, like if you've seen like a vampire movie or a werewolf movie, you know they had to go through this transition. And it's just like going through those transitions, if you know, if you ever watched any uh, vampire werewolves, you know, their, their, their senses has been heightened. You know, I don't want to say like we're going to turn into a beast or anything like that, but you know, their senses, you know, their seven senses or six senses, what, how, how many senses we got, it's all, you know, it's changed. You know, your eyes are just, you know, you're seeing things in a different light that you're usually seeing things at. You know, you're touching things. You know, the vibration is just your energy. You know, y'all see mine. If you've been with me for a while, you'll know that my energy has changed. It, I mean, changed tremendously. Um, just being able to do things that, you know, I'm not normally doing. Like, if I think about my dad, I seen, remember my dad talking about chemtrails and, you know, different things. Because they always thought my dad was just about music and music alone. My dad was out there you know very out there you know some people call him weird I think he's eccentric you know he's very different I love the way he does things because it's different you know he's not ordinary nobody cannot put him in a box you know even though they tried to and try to compare him to things the different people you really couldn't because he's he's in a leap of his own you know he's by himself you can say some people say you know he kind of reminds me of Jimi Hendrix you know yeah in a way when when they do the music and stuff like that but they were their own people and it's just like I feel that now since we're like combined in that way I feel different things out the way he does like that this ain't me but it's just something that you know he is instilled inside of me you know being able to do that is such a beautiful thing being able to see things in a different way in a different perspective knowing that my mind is just like a soaking sponge just able to learn anything that my hands could get a hold of it's just like I love it and as before, I'm just like, it is what it is. You know, if it's meant for me to know, hey, I'll know it. But now I'm just like, I want to learn. I want to do this. I want to do that. Because it's pushing me out of my comfort zone. It got me looking at things a different way that I can bring towards my channel. Helping other people do the same for themselves, and which is a true blessing. You always, you know, if you're going to be making videos or anything, you know, everybody has their own thing on doing YouTube. You know, people do challenges. Some people are, you know, gossip bloggers. You know, the things that are going on in the world, they're bringing it, you know, they're discussing it on their uh, on their channels. You know, there's gaming. You know, people do different, you know, animation or jokes and stuff like that so it's just so many different things that you know are bringing towards the table that people love to do that they're you know bringing you know forth attention on is like with mine spirituality you know getting out of your comfort zone healing from whatever has hindered you or hurt you or abused you in the past knowing that you are bigger than what people you know try to put you out to be you know don't place yourself in a box when you're not meant to be in a box don't be malefic towards yourself because usually if you're malefic towards yourself you're doing it towards other people you know I just try to always do that and now it's just like what now with me and my dad converting into this situation is like this big beautiful massive energy that's so beautiful that I'm really I'm getting intrigued to where where is my mind gonna take me today you know what what kind of interest am I gonna fall in love with now and it's just like you know I hear my dad saying you know I'm so proud of you you know because I always think you know is my dad gonna be proud of me for the things I do and he's like yes I'm so proud of you because you're you know I was rough around the edges when me and him first met and I was just like going through the motions and not really knowing where I was and now it's just like after you know going on three years of him being passed it's like my mind has like expanded towards something that's like unknown and for me even you know even some certain things that i'm going venturing towards my dad wasn't aware of you know and it's just like oh i'm so proud of you and i'm so happy that you're doing this and you know, i'm so happy you're doing that but it's just like when you're on your everyday basis you're pushing yourself out that box don't ever put yourself in a don't limit yourself to things that are very unlimited you know the world and knowledge is unlimited to you and that's what you need to do for yourself being able to change something that's so blah and ordinary to something very extraordinary being able to know that you know what i'm going to be the best i can be i'm not going to be be a person that just settles I'm not going to be that person that's just big I want to you know put my purpose to get used and th that is a true blessing that's what you need to do that's what we're born to do and knowing that you know you keep going you're striving you're surviving you're doing things that is going to put you in a better light put, you know give you better energy you know where you don't have to worry you know you're pushing yourself out towards things that you know you will truly enjoy and love about yourself and love about others as well so I hope you were able to 
you know uh resonate with the content of this video much love to everybody it's not really that that long so it's just like when they ask me to go ahead and speak on things i go ahead and speak on it and you know and it's just a true blessing when i'm when i ask for more content or things that they need me to go ahead and you know push out towards that day you know there that's the blessings that i'm able to get for that so you know usually if we just pray on stuff it usually takes a minute but with them when it comes to content like that boom 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 i get it like that i'm like thank you i wish everything worked like that but hey you know it is what it is you know everything else gotta have time into but I hope you were able to resonate with the content in this video. Like and subscribe. Even hit that notification bell. Drop me a line. I love the chance to hear from you. You know, what kind of alchemy are you pulling towards your life? What are the things that you're going towards now that you weren't usually going for before? You know, it's just a bit thing when you're you're you know when you're soaking up all the knowledge and stuff that you're going towards. You know, pushing your own envelope stepping out your comfort zone getting out there and doing things that you truly love and enjoy instead of you know just being of being <laughs> you know that cause this life is not is not meant for that you're supposed to be able to you know do stuff that you enjoy you know we see a lot of people doing that so why can't you do the same so uh you know drop me a line i would love a chance to hear from you um let me see who am i going to get my post notification out to raiku Vaughn, um, you know, I don't know how to pronounce the last name, but you know who I'm talking about. Much love to you, sis. I love you to death. Stacy Foley, um, Ollie P1 uh, underscore one, uh, Lauren 376. Much love to you and job for life. Many love and blessings. And I will see you on my next video. Have a blessed, safe weekend. Be responsible for everything you do. Yeah, turn up, turn up, but just don't act all crazy. You know, take care of yourself, though, y'all. You know out there but anyways i hope you enjoy your weekend stay blessed stay safe you know that you are truly blessed forever favored and always loved and knowing there's always somebody out there praying for your better days and i'll see you on my next video y'all peace and be wild